Try to be a little more quiet in the court. Certainly, Judgey, the gate is locked. Would you please step forward? No, no, no. Prepare yourself for the witness box. Take off your hat. Now raise your right hand. Now place your left hand here. Take off your hat. Raise your right hand. Now put your left hand here. Please take off your hat. Raise your right hand. Hmm. Now put your left hand here. Will you please take off your hat? Raise your right hand. Hmm. Now put your left hand here. Take off your hat. Raise your right hand. Will you get rid of that hat? Raise your right hand. Raise your right hand. Do you solemnly swear to tell us who told you that nothing was the truth? Huh? Do you solemnly swear to tell us who told you that nothing was the truth? Are you trying to give me the double talk? Do you solemnly swear to tell us who told you that nothing was the truth? Why don't you answer him? He's talking big like I don't know what he's saying. He's asking you if you swear. No, but I know all the words. He's asking you if you swear to tell the truth. Truth is stranger than fiction, Judgey Woody. <laughs> Kindly address this court as your honor and take the oath. Do you solemnly swear to tell the truth, hold to that other but the truth? Certainly. What have I got to lose? Take the stand. Where did I put it? No, no. Take the stand. I got it. Now what will I do with it? Tempest? 
in any way, shape, or form, commit or try to commit bodily harm to the deceased Kirk Robin? I object, Your Honor. House is trying to lead the witness. Objection sustained. Mr. Howard, did you see Miss Gail Tempest in physical fight with Kirk Robin? If it pleases the court, may I suggest that counsel be instructed to allow the witness to testify to what he saw? I say, Jasper, uh, what comes after 75? 76. That's the spirit. <laughs> Request granted. Proceed with the testimony. Mr. Howard, kindly tell the court what you know about the murder of Kirk Robin. Well, it was like this, Mr. Court. Address the judge as your honor. Well, it was like this, my honor. Your honor, not my honor. Why? Don't you like him? Allow the witness to proceed. The court understands him. Thanks, Court. You're a pal. Well, me and my pals, we're musicians. We were tearing up some hot swing music in the orchestra. Gail over there was swinging the fans. Her sweetie, Kirk Robin, was inhaling a bottle of hooch at a table. And a hoofer by the name of Buck Wing was getting ready to shake his tootsies. Kindly speak English and drop the vernacular. Vernacular? That's a me. Drop the vernacular. No, no, not that. Talk so the jury can understand. Is everybody done? Say, Judgey, if you let me, my partner, and Gailey kind of act it out for you, we'll show you just what happened. If counsel doesn't object, that's an excellent idea. No objections. No objections. No objections. <laughs> okay, Gailey. What's the matter? 
You want to kill me? Why is preposterous? When the police broke into the office, they found this woman, the defendant, Gail Tempest, bending over the body of a murdered man with a revolver cutting in her hand. Which only goes to prove that my client is innocent. Innocent? Exactly, and I'll prove it. Ladies and gentlemen, the action of this pistol is so hard, it would take the strength of a mule to pull the trigger. Try it. I'm no mule. No, your ears are too short. <laughs> so I'm a mule. Pull the trigger. Never fear, it's not loaded. How could Gail Tempest's frail little finger pull the rusty trigger of that instrument of destruction? See, there was nothing in it. Broad Lane, 9972, after 5 o'clock. What you do with my boat in the air? Give me that gun. What happened? Why don't you want that gun Every man for himself, fellas. Ah, there you are, boss. You were calling me a witness, wasn't you? Certainly. So was you. What are you buttoning in for? You're supposed to be a good one, ain't you? Well, ain't I? Now, what are you have to stay in the court for? Here. <laughs> Stop chewing that gum. Fight me. Will you throw that gum away? Look, I got rid of it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold still. I'll get it. Ow! Ow, my nose! mean by find the letter. There's a whole pile of letters there. What's he here? Look, there's a note tied to the parrot's foot. Come on, Polly, 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 Polly. Come on, Polly, Polly, Polly. Come on, Polly, Polly, Polly. Come on. Ouch! Look out, here it comes. Here's that parrot. Thank you. 